Back at the Pro Football Hall of Fame at Canton, Ohio. It's uh, Mac Media Day, and uh, along with us, Brett Gabbard, uh, six-year senior for the uh, Miami Redhawks. And, man, it is good to see you and good to see that you're going to be playing another season for Miami. Thank you. Appreciate it. Good to see you as well. All right, man. Let's go back. You know, I talked to you, if you remember, you were on one of the training tables after the leg injury and, you know, I, I know at that point you were just like, you know, you were down. I'm sure you were. How do you keep battling back? Where do you find that strength to get back out onto the field? Yeah, you know, I'm not going to sit here and, you know, lie, but the first, shoot, probably three months were, you know, extremely hard. Like, you know, for the first month I was on crutches and a um, or I was just on crutches. I couldn't right. put my foot down. Uh, second month, I was on crutches and a boot. And then finally, the third month, I was able to, you know, ditch the crutches and just walk with a boot. But, um, you know, finally just being able to, like, walk for the first time in three months was big. But, you know, I had a ton of support, whether it was family, friends, teammates, coaches, coaches from other schools reaching out, players from other schools, um, just rooting for me, you know, wishing me well. Um, which was really awesome that it really went a long way. And now, you know, everybody that's followed Miami football, that wasn't your first injury. I mean, you know, a couple of years ago no. down in Kentucky and then, yep. you know, last season. And then there's been a few other times you've been down a little bit. Yep. And I just give you all the credit in the world. I mean that for battling back. It, it uh, any any corporation anywhere at some point would love to have somebody like you working for them. I will tell you that, young man. Appreciate it. Yeah, you know, there's definitely been a couple bumps in the road throughout the... More than a couple. Yeah, throughout my five years. Um, but, you know, at the end of the day, you just got to keep going. Um, and it sounds corny, but you just never give up. All right. Uh, sixth year, you certainly know. Um, you've seen a lot of defenses thrown at you. you. I mean, so I know you expect big things from this Miami team this season. You guys have some veterans and some newcomers that are going to contribute. Yeah, you know, we, we had a great team last year. Um, unfortunately, you know, lost some guys to graduation in the portal, and, you know, that happens. But, you know, we have a ton of young guys, and we got some guys in the portal as well that are going to help us. So, you know, I, I have big expectations not only for myself, but uh, more importantly the team. So, um, you know, our goal is always to go to a bowl game, win the bowl game, and also go to the MAC championship and, and win that as well. You've been to this event before is that correct yeah this Here? is uh yeah, my second, third my third, third one. one yeah, yeah. third one <laughs> so what'd you guys uh, do last night you, you and matt Sullivan. uh so last night we we were actually we, we came here um got a cool tour i've never been here before so it was actually awesome uh, pretty awesome to see all the history of uh football um and then after they had like some golf simulators upstairs so and they had food for us. We just ate dinner and you know hit some golf balls. It was super fun. I can't believe you guys would be out hitting golf balls, but you know, before the event started, we were talking. Now you and Matt been playing a little golf this summer. Is that correct? Yep, correct. And Matt has not been taking any of your money out of your pocket, right? No, no, we don't. We don't do that. But uh, <laughs> um, you know, Sal Salopek is he's he's a really good golfer. Uh, you know, if we play ten times, you know. I'm probably beating him five. He's probably beating me five. But you shot par the other day. Yeah, technically I have the best score. Um, I think his personal best is a 74. Uh, my personal best is a 72. So, you know. You have to invite Matt out to the golf course when you're going to shoot par. And you right. think you shot two under the other day. So that's when you have to get Matt Salopek out on the golf course. Right. I got I to gotta plan it right next time. All right, before I let you go, I think that culture at Miami, and, and largely due to Chuck Martin and his staff, mm -hmm. certainly the players, uh, it is a culture of winning. And, I, you know, going into this season, I know you guys have very, very high expectations, as does everyone else here, all the other teams. But I think this is, I think you guys have an excellent chance of repeating as champions in 2024. Yeah, you know, it's never easy to win a championship in general, and it's it's even harder to go back to back. Mm -hmm. But um, ever since my freshman year in 2019, uh, when we won it, you know the expectations just get higher and higher and higher. Once you have uh, previous success, so um, you know I'm going to take it one day at a time, one game at a time. Not really try and look too far ahead into the future, but um, 
I definitely I like our team. I like our staff. I like our coaches. So I, I think we we have a good chance to do what we want to do. Brett, nice talking to you. Everybody's good, right? Family's good. Everybody's oh, doing yeah. great. Oh yeah, great. Yep. Uh, yes, right. sir. Thanks again. Yep. Thank you.